hello and welcome today in this video i will show you how you can activate dark themes in google chrome and on this system i am using mx linux so you can also use dark themes in linux first of all if i go to settings and appearance you can see i have two options i can use classic theme which is default theme or i can use gtk plus theme Actually, I have activated a dark theme on my system. So you can see if I change theme, it is using the default GTK theme or it is using my system themes. As it's very simple and easy to change your themes. But if you are using Windows or Mac, you can also use dark theme. Now let's close the setting. And if you go to Google Play Store, we can find some dark themes here. So here you can see we have a lot of themes available. So let's try this one. Click Add to Chrome. And now you can see this theme has been installed you can undo the, your changes now if you are using google chrome on your android device let me show you how you can activate dark theme here you can see the live screen of my android device if you go to settings here you can see say, themes option and now you can choose from light and dark theme or you can also uh, uh, choose from uh, choose the system default So it's up to you now if you are using windows system or mac you can find uh, some useful information here at how to be they have a this gu uh, guide so you can see google chrome doesn't have a built-in dark theme like mozilla firefox or microsoft edge so you can see you have option to enable dark mode on windows 10 and mac os and let me increase some font size so you can Read it clearly in Google Chrome Google Chrome gained a built-in dark theme on Windows in Chrome 74 and on Mac OS in Chrome 73 to enable Chrome's dark theme just switch your operating system to dark mode on Windows 10 you can find this useful information head to settings personalization colors and select dark under choose your default app mode on Mac enable the system wide dark mode so you can easily enable dark theme on your windows linux mac or android device so this is just a quick tip thank you very much for watching this video